sexual reproduction of bacteria. So true sexual reproduction is absent here, but the segment of genetic material has been transferred from one bacterium to another bacterium. So it means genetic material exchange is take place here. So that leads to the genetic recombinations. Okay. So three types of the sexual reproduction is reported in bacteria or reported in bacteria. One is transformation, another one is conjugation and transduction. Transformation. So transformation means uptake of naked DNA by bacterial DNA which is present into the uh, its uh, surrounding environment. So that is said as transformation that is found in Streptococcus pneumonia by scientist Frederick Griffith. Then conjugation. So conjugation is here genetic material is exchanged, genetic material is transferred through one particular structure that is conjugation tube. Here uh, it is found in E. coli bacteria by Ledenberg and Tatum. So in 1946 they discovered, so between two bacterial cells the conjugation is happened. How it is going on means? You are seeing here two types of the strains, one is F plus and another one is F minus. F plus indicates fertile factor. So plus means it is positive, positive means it consists fertile plasmid, so it do not consist. So uh, the F plus strain is called as donor cell and F minus is recipient, recipient means it ready to take, so but it is giving to ready. Okay. So donor and recipient, between these two the conjugation procedure is going on. So the conjugation procedure is nothing but of genetic material transfer. Okay. So you are seeing between these two for their contact they come together, these two are called as conjugants, conjugants. So two conjugants the conjugation is taken. So between these two the sexual pili is worked as a conjugational tube. So what is conjugational tube? The conjugational tube is, this is the via the genetic material is transferred from donor cell to respirant, uh, recipient cell. Okay. So here before going to the conjugation, after uh, their attachment through the conjugational tube here the plasmid is going to replicate. So the replica form is transferred to through the conjugational tube into the F minus cell. So you see here through this the F uh, uh, through conjugational tube the replicated plasmid is inserted. Sometimes here two types interrupted and uninterrupted. Uninterrupted conditions Normally the replicated plasmid is went to the gone to the next recipient cell. But in uninterrupted conditions here, in uninterrupted conditions all the small segment of the plasmid when entered into the F minus, it has the ability to complete production of the plasmid also. Okay, but here you are seeing the transfer of replicated or replica of the plasmid. Okay, so the F factor is entered into the F minus cell, then the F minus cell is turned into the F plus cell with full of plasmid. So here the completed conjugation, it means end of the conjugation the F minus cell is, the recipient cell is turned as a donor cell, that is the variation. So here the genetic material is transferred from F plus cell to F minus cell, okay. So that is conjugation, this phenomena found in E. coli cells by the Ledenberg and Gender in 1946. Next transduction, transduction means here also genetic material transfer. So the genetic material DNA uh, is transferred um, from one bacterium to next bacterium, another bacterium through bacteriophages, bacteriophages. 
okay so transfer of genetic material from one bacterium to another bacterium through bacteriophages the phenomena is called transduction that found by ledenberg and gender okay in salmonella type immuniarum okay so this is about the reproduction of bacteria